What's up guys, this is DT Ninja here to bring you my special unboxing. Yes guys, this is my second unboxing. Uh, so, I have got some items from Japan and I have to share with you guys what I got. So, yeah, let's get to it. Uh, my trusty uh, box here. I got it from FedEx and this is from CD Japan. So, if you guys ever want to get some authentic uh, Japanese uh, items, you know, manga, anime, whatever collectibles you like I mean this is a place to go CD Japan it's a great website um, yeah so let's see what we got here alright yo 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 bleach volume 65 yes yes zombies zombies bleach chapter 65 so Obviously, this is gonna be an epic volume, right? Yes, 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 Ichigo's return, yo! Yo, and Juha, Juha. Alright. And then, you know, we gotta show Candy and Ichigo. Ichigo cuts through lightning, yo! Ichigo cutting through lightning, uh, yo, that is just so epic. And then, and then, we get to God Jujisho, yo, look at this! Get to God Jujisho, I have to show, it's two pages. You get get to God Juju Show, that is freaking awesome. Next part, you know, Oswald's bringing the sword out, turning the light, you know? And then Juha's like, yo, you have to thank those who guided us to this light. Yo, such an epic part. And then Besby shows up, you know, and Ichigo sees the light in the back. And then Juha speaks, you know, to Ichigo. You know, we're going up to the palace. And then Ichigo heads towards there. And then, you know, Uryu and Ichigo. Yo, Uryu and Ichigo. Oh, this part's so epic. I love this part. Yo, and Chad and Orihime. Yo. I remember this chapter because I colored this chapter almost the entire thing. Here. I don't know how I missed that part. Udahar is here. You know, the uh, Giselle. The crazy character. And then, you know, Mayuri shows up to fight. And then we get the Aran car showing up. And then, yo, yo, at the end, yo, yo, Toshiro. Oh, the first time I saw that. And then there's even a preview of the next volume. So the next thing we're going to look at is, yo, yo. Naruto Volume 71, yes, yes, Naruto Volume 71, look at this cover, yo, that's his story, we learn how Madara was saved, you know, back in the cave, and now here are the, the, the Madaras here, the, the clones that he supposedly, and then, you know, here's, Kaguya crying, you know, with the thousands of clones, and then he, he reaches into the dimension. But then we see Obito reaches the dimension as well. And then, you know, she uses the bone technique against him. Sasuke. You know, Sasuke running. Sasuke saving Sakura. Look at that, yo! Special cover, yo! Like a Wild West cover. And then, you know, the new dimension of, like, uh, gravity. Guys, I wanted to show you one more part of this, uh, this manga. Because, I mean, th this is an incredible 
a moment in, in, you know, the fight between Kaguya. I mean, just look at this. You got all the characters, Kakashi, Naruto, Sasuke, Sakura, and Kaguya. And, you know, she brings the, uh, you know, the the whole planet to, you know, the, gra the gravity. Uh, he, he saves Kakashi's life. And then, you know, he tells Naruto he's going to become Hokage. He, he goes back and gives Kakashi the Sharingan. And then Kakashi, Kakashi using Susano. And here is the Shuriken. Here's the final ceiling. Yo, Naruto taking out uh, Black Zetsu, and then all the all the Kages revived to take out Kaguya, and then you know the Ninja World is saved. So that is Naruto Volume 71. I hope you guys enjoy. Yeah, so the next part, yo yo, the next thing is Naruto the official data book. Yo Naruto the official data book. Uh, so I just want to share this with you guys because you guys probably don't know this, but the cover actually comes out This is what it actually looks like the cover and then the back look at the back the back looks epic you know you got Sasuke and uh, Sakura and then all of the uh, you know the supporting characters on the other side so and Then from this one. I mean this is awesome Naruto there this, if I can get in here close with you guys, look at this color page here. I mean, that is awesome. The fourth Ninja War, all of the characters, all the supporting characters, everyone from all the villages. I mean, this is incredible. Awesome stuff. Awesome stuff from Kishimoto. And it's just an awesome, awesome color page by Kishimoto. I, I love these color pages. They're awesome. And then this one is awesome too. We got the return of Team 7. Yo, the return of Team 7. Yo, awesome stuff. Explain, like, look at this. The darkness shown as Sasuke on the blue side, right? And then the light part is Naruto. And this is interesting because, you know, you got the Buddhist side here, the Hinduism side here, and, you know, you got Naruto here and Sasuke here. So the two sides of one coin. So pretty awesome. I really like this part. Several characters. There's a whole thing on Kaguya. Um, let's see. I just want to flip through here because this is basically... Because you guys are probably wondering what you know, Kaguya's part looks like. This is what Kaguya's part looks like. It's it's pretty uh, comprehensible. I mean, there's a lot of stuff here. Agaromo and the ceiling technique, you know, it tells a little bit behind the actual, uh, the seal. It's a little bit more about Hamura. And by the way, guys, if you guys didn't know, Hamura is the leader of the Otsutsuki clan after this because, you know, as we know, Hagaroma was sealed in the Jubi, and Jubi was Kaguya, so that means he was the one to seal his brother into the moon, and he went up there, you know, uh, and he became the leader of the Otsutsuki clan. Uh, here's Gara's father. Okay, Gara's father actually has a name. His name's Rasa. Rasa. Gara's father is epic. I like Gara's father. Um, then there's one about Gara. Gara's an awesome character. He's one of my favorite characters. Definitely Gara. Gara's awesome. You know, it just tells a little bit about him, how he, you know, was in darkness. And then it shows his speech, you know, uh, saying, you know, Naruto saved him that day, so we have to save him now. Uh, here's Kakashi's. Like I said, I can't show you all of them. There's so many. Here's Tsunade, Killer B. Let's see if I can find. Here's one about Mu. Mu. One about Hashirama. Uh, you know, the thousand hand Buddha technique. Look at that. Yo, so yeah, this has just been a quick look at Naruto the data book. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, yeah, so like I said, I will be doing a review on that as well. And look, this is uh, Naruto Road to Ninja, so it's got a full page here, Road to Ninja. Uh, you know, you got the uh, the ninjas on the top, the ninjas on the bottom, pretty cool. Inside, 
the movie, you know, you got Hinata, a little uh, fan service there, Hinata. And is really cool. We got Masashi Kishimoto, his final words, and an interview with the Masashi Kishimoto. So, uh, you know, someone's asking him questions, and he reveals uh, a little bit about himself. He he reveals that this story is based about his life. He used real life experiences, and Naruto is actually representing him and how he changes throughout the story. So I thought that was really cool. And it's got a little uh, final message from Kishimoto. So. So, yeah, and then his signature. So, yeah, it's pretty cool. Uh, that's pretty much it for the data book. Uh, three things, right? We've looked at Naruto uh, Volume 71. We've looked at uh, Bleach uh, Volume 65. And we looked at Naruto, the data book. You know, the official data book. Now, we have more to look at. All right. Yo, I got the official, the official Rurouni Kenshin the movie, the movie, this is a notebook, a notebook from the new movie, yes guys, the Kyoto Inferno, and you know, this is, this is awesome, so this is what the back looks like, this is what the front looks like, and it's just an everyday, you know, uh, just a notebook, it's pretty awesome, it shows, uh, you know, him, uh, you know, as a samurai down here. I don't know, it's just, it's really cool. I thought it was really cool, so I got it. Another thing I got was Rurouni Kenshin. Yes, guys, this is the official story novel of Rurouni, Ken of Rurouni Kenshin. So uh, this is actually a storybook. So I'm, I'm interested in reading this uh, just, just for the novelty, you know, not, not just reading uh, comics, but actual words. So this is, this covers epic i mean yo look at this cover uh, so epic and then i'm gonna share because the the cover is amazing i mean look at this cover you got kenshin and kaoru here you know that is awesome and then the inside yo the inside has their their original couple you know kenshin and tomo uh his wife you know so that is just awesome it's like uh, past and present, you know, past and present, so I really like that, that cover, I mean, even just to get the cover and everything, it's worth it, I mean, and to read, uh, this is what it looks like, guys, I mean, this is what a novel looks like in Japanese, and then here, a couple more pages, here, Watsuki, so this is, this is awesome, it's an official novel of the series, I'm guessing it probably covers the first uh, part or uh, some of the main parts that happen. So this is definitely a collector's item. Oh, yo, yo, I had to do it. Yo, Moroni Kenshin, Master of Flame, Shishio side story. Yo, I got the cover. The cover looks epic, yo. Look at this. Look at this cover. So epic. You have this uh, poster you get of Master of Flame. Look at that. Poster of Master of Flame. Awesome stuff. This is going to be perfect for my review next uh, coming up because I, I, I finished it. But actually, guys, yo, it's not over. It's not over. There are ten chapters. Uh, you know, not ten chapters. There are two parts in, in the, uh, the, the, the book. Uh, have been released, but there is text. There is more to the story that I have not read, so I'm so hyped. Profiles, just like in the data book, you know, you got Uswi the Blind Sword, you know, all of the Ten Swords, and then you know we start out with Kinshin, you know, bringing it to you know uh, Igase, Igase. I think his name's I Igase. Ooh fighting uh kenshin so this is it but then but then look at this it's not over yo it's not over there's more to the story you just have to read it you just have to read it it's a novel form like this uh yeah and i have one more thing all right the last thing is roni kenshin the official guidebook the official guidebook look at this cover yo look at this cover pretty epic you know look at this each 
character represents one of the the volumes so I have to do a review on this so this has been my unboxing I hope you guys enjoyed and as always have